Fifty years ago this weekend, many of us witnessed something truly out of this world when American astronauts landed and then walked on the moon. The eagle has landed. That's one small step for man. Among the half billion watching around the world that night was a young man from Montreal spending the summer working as a camp counselor in the Adirondacks. Suddenly, silence. You could hear a pin drop in the auditorium. These are some of these kids are six years old, and they know something's going to happen. And he steps down the ladder and he gets on the uh, on the moon and he does his little speech. And uh, it was absolutely incredible to see it there. I've never you, forgotten that. Something you would never forget for the rest of your life. Never, never. And did it only fuel your interest in love and passion? Well, my passion was pretty, pretty serious at the time, but it, it helped. Oh, yeah. <clears throat> you don't forget something like that. That young man fascinated by the night sky would become a renowned astronomer and one of the world's greatest comet hunters. Dr. David Levy, who co-discovered the Shoemaker-Levy 9 comet, which collided with Jupiter in 1994, has discovered 23 comets in all. Dr. Levy gave a talk recently at SUNY Plattsburgh. And he has just published his autobiography, The Night Watchman's Journey, The Road Not Taken, which he will be discussing and signing copies of on Wednesday night, July 31st at Tupper Lake High School in Tupper Lake. It comes right on the heels of the Adirondack Sky Festival being held this Sunday, July 21st, celebrating the anniversary of the moon landing and efforts to build a state-of-the-art observatory and astroscience center in Tupper Lake, tentatively set to open in 2024.